Most EV batteries don't just wear out, they're slowly getting killed by small habits drivers ignore every day. And the scary part? It's 100% preventable. Just 10 minutes once a month can save you from early battery degradation, thousands in replacement costs, and the nightmare of watching your range drop year after year. Do this one simple thing and your EV's battery could easily outlast the car itself. And wait until you hear the final tip. It's the secret that can turn a 200-mile EV into a 500,000-mile legend. Let's get right into it. Tip number 10. Check your charging habits. Starting with the most common misconception, most people plug in their EV every night and charge it all the way to 100%, thinking more is perfect, but that's actually the fastest way to wear out the battery. These lithium-ion batteries are sort of like us. They hate staying at full stress or full rest for too long. Keeping your charge between about 20 and 80% helps the battery stay relaxed and healthy. When it's always full, the cells are stretched tight and the chemistry inside starts to break down faster. Tesla, Recurrent, and Battery University all notice the same thing that charging to 100% every day can cut years off a battery's life. So you need a full charge if you're going on a long trip. Otherwise, staying in that middle zone keeps everything calm and balanced. Most EVs even let you set a charging limit so you can stop it automatically at 80% and that's genius. Tip number 9. Balance DC Fast Charging and AC Charging Moving on to the next tip. DC fast chargers are handy when you're in a rush, but using them too often cooks your battery from the inside out. Every time you plug into a fast charger, a ton of power rushes in quickly, and that creates a lot of heat. Heat is the silent killer of battery cells, and over time, it makes the materials inside swell and crack, which lowers your battery's ability to hold charge. Home charging, also called AC charging, is much gentler. It feeds power slowly, keeping the cells cool and stable. That's why experts suggest checking your charging history once a month. If more than 30% of your charging sessions are fast charges, you're stressing the battery more than you need to. So a good rule of thumb is fast charge for road trips, home charge for everyday use. One smart trick is to look at your car's app or dashboard and see your charge pattern. Aim for at least 70% home charging. Tip number 8. Inspect charging port and cable Besides the charging action itself, there are other simple ways to make your battery last longer and that's tip number 8. A quick look at your charging port and cable once a month can save you from some nasty surprises. Dust, moisture, or a bit of rust can sneak into those tiny metal contacts and make charging harder for your car. When the connection isn't clean, it creates resistance, and resistance makes heat. Too much heat, and you'll just end up looking at melted plugs or, in rare cases, small fires. You don't even need any fancy tools for this. Just unplug the charger, look inside the port with a flashlight, and check if everything looks clean and shiny. If you see any dirt or white powdery spots, wipe them gently with a dry cloth. A few seconds of cleaning can prevent energy loss and keep your charging smooth and safe. You'll be surprised by how many EV owners have absolutely no idea their cables are slowly getting damaged. Tip number 7. Run a full battery calibration cycle For tip number 7, letting your EV's battery run from full to low once in a while helps the system know its true capacity. Every EV has something called the Battery Management System, or BMS, which keeps track of how much energy is really inside. Over time, those readings drift and the car starts showing wrong range numbers. Doing one full charge to 100% and then driving down to around 10% once every month or two helps the BMS reset its calculations. Drivers who never do this sometimes panic when their range suddenly drops or jumps overnight. That's not the battery dying, it's actually the software getting confused. A full calibration cycle helps your car give you honest readings, especially if you use it daily. It also helps detect weak cells before they turn into a big problem. Some brands even suggest doing this before long trips, just to get the most accurate range estimate. Just keep in mind to do it in moderation. Once every month or two is perfectly fine. Doing it every week would wear the battery out faster. Tip number 6. Check Tire Pressure and Alignment you might not know this, but low tire pressure quietly eats away at your EV's range and battery health. And that brings us to number 6. When your tires are even a little soft, they create more rolling resistance, which means your motor has to work harder just to keep the car moving. 
That extra effort drains your battery faster and makes you charge more often, which shortens battery life over time. So what you need to do is check your tire pressure once a month, especially when the weather changes. Cold air can make tires lose pressure overnight. Even being 5 PSI too low can cost you up to 10% of your range. Keep a small tire gauge in your glove box or use a pressure display on your dashboard if your car has one. Alignments matter too. If your car drifts a little when you let go of the steering wheel, that's a sign it's out of line. Properly inflated and aligned tires roll a lot smoother, help you get the most out of every charge and even make the car feel more responsive. Tip number 5. Monitor Battery Temperature Behavior After a long drive or a full charge, your EV's battery gets warm. And that's normal. But if you ever notice the cooling fans running for way too long after parking or not coming on at all when they used to, that's a huge red flag. But don't worry, we've got you with this tip number 5. The cooling system keeps the battery at a safe temperature. And if it's not working right, the pack can overheat. When the battery cells stay too hot for too long, they lose capacity permanently. But you can check this easily by listening after you park or by watching your EV app for temperature alerts or cooling system messages. Some cars even let you view live battery temps in their service menu. A few extra minutes of listening or looking once a month can save you thousands of dollars later. Tip number 4. Update Software and Battery Management Firmware Now, your EV software isn't just about the touchscreen or driving modes. It also controls how the battery charges, cools, and protects itself. Manufacturers like Tesla, Rivian, Hyundai regularly send software updates that improve how the battery handles heat, adjusts charging curves, or balance cells during charging. These updates can quietly add years to your battery's life without you even noticing. That's why you should keep this tip number 4 in mind. Always have your car connected to Wi-Fi at home. Many updates are too large to download over mobile data, and without Wi-Fi, your EV might skip them completely. You can usually check the software version and update history in your settings or mobile app to see if you've missed any. Skipping updates might not seem like a big deal, but it's like refusing an oil change in a gas car. After some time, old firmware can cause inefficient charging, slower range estimates, or even overheating problems that newer software fixes automatically. Tip number 3. Keep the cabin and battery cool Because heat is the number one reason EV batteries wear out faster, keeping both the cabin and the battery cool is one of the smartest things you can do. And that's tip number 3 we've got for you. Parking in shade during the day keeps the battery temperature from climbing too high. If your EV has cabin overheat protection, make sure it's turned on, especially in summer. This feature automatically runs fans to keep the inside and, by extension, the battery below it cooler. Also, use your app to pre-cool the car before driving instead of blasting the air conditioner once you're inside. When you cool it while it's still plugged in, that power comes from the charger, not your battery. Oh, another small but helpful trick is scheduling your charging for nighttime. This is because when the temperature drops, the battery stays cooler while charging, which helps reduce chemical stress. Tip number 2. Check for parasitic drains. Even when your EV is just left still, it can slowly lose energy if accessories or the 12-volt battery keep waking the high voltage pack. This is called parasitic drain or vampire drain. Small drains can add up over time, taking off hundreds of battery cycles if left unchecked. And that brings us to tip number two. Once a month, open your EV app or dashboard and check your energy graph or battery report. Look for unusual drops when the car hasn't been driven. Common culprits of this are aftermarket electronics, Bluetooth devices, or a 12-volt battery that's starting to fail. But fixing these drains is usually simple. For starters, replace an old 12-volt battery, disconnect non-essential accessories, or adjust settings that keep systems awake unnecessarily. If you've made it this far, then hit that like button. It tells YouTube that this video's worth saving your battery. And we'll be able to deliver more helpful videos like this. Tip number 1. Monthly Visual and System Check – The Ritual Finally, here's tip number one. Once a month, open your EV app or dashboard diagnostics and do a quick system check. It's a mini health exam for your car. Check the battery health percentage to see if it's holding charge like it should. Look at coolant levels or any warning alerts that pop up. Scan your charging history and error codes for anything unusual. 
This 5-minute ritual helps you spot most problems before they become headaches that'll cost you thousands of dollars in repair. Small issues like a slow fan, an unbalanced cell, or a parasitic drain show up here first, and that gives you a chance to fix them early and save a huge chunk of your money. Remember, 10 minutes a month keeps your EV strong for years. See you in the next video.